36 Old English Sheepdog Facts Every Owner Should Know Number 1. The majestic Old English Sheepdog boasts an impressive stature. Males command attention at a striking 22 inches in height, with their robust bodies weighing in between 80 and 100 pounds, while their female counterparts stand gracefully at 21 inches and weigh 60 to 85 pounds. Number 2. Old English Sheepdogs are known for their distinctive and resonant bark, often likened to the sound of two pots colliding or a cracked bell in French referred to as pot cassis. This bark is a clear indicator that your furry companion is keen on alerting you whenever something out of the ordinary occurs. Number 3. With their double coat, Old English Sheepdogs are equipped with both a soft, insulating outer layer and a rugged, water-resistant outer layer, offering essential protection against different weather conditions. Number 4. If you're wondering whether you've seen an Old English Sheepdog before, that's likely because of the breed's starring role in beloved Disney films. One of the most memorable appearances comes in the form of the Shaggy Dog, where a magical ring works its enchantment, turning a young boy into something rather shaggy indeed. Number 5. Even in the enchanting tale of The Little Mermaid, Prince Eric's loyal canine companion is none other than Max, a charming and affectionate representative of the English sheepdog breed. Number 6. These magnificent canines boast a striking coat, blending hues of pristine white with varying shades of elegant gray or mesmerizing blue merle. The subtle interplay of these tones, coupled with occasional patches of diluted black, creates a truly captivating visual spectacle. Number 7. Young Sheepdog Puppies don't boast the iconic gray and white fur they're known for. Instead, they come into the world with a striking black and white coat. As they grow, a beautiful spectrum of gray and silver tones emerges, usually around the age of two. It's a fascinating transformation that adds to their charm and uniqueness. Number 8. The Old English Sheepdog's eyes, when visible, come in shades of dark brown, blue, or even one of each. If the dog is brown-eyed, then darker hues are always preferred. On the other hand, blue-eyed individuals typically have a pearl, china, or walleye. Number 9. According to the AKC breed standard, for the Old English Sheepdog, both the skull and jaws are squarely formed. Attention is brought to the features, as a long, narrow head or snippy muzzle is a deformity. Number 10. The breed standard continues to specify that the tail should be docked close to the body unless the dog is naturally bobtailed. The American Veterinary Medical Association, however, holds a stance in opposition to the practice of cosmetic tail docking. Number 11. Originally, these dogs played an essential role as drovers' companions, skillfully herding cattle and sheep to market. These distinctive canines were easily identified by their cropped tails, earning them endearing nicknames like Bob or Bob Tail in recognition of their invaluable work. Number 12. Initially seen as a symbol of affluence, the Old English Sheepdog underwent a transformation in the 1960s, evolving into a cherished family companion. Nevertheless, by the mid-1970s, their appeal waned as the demands of caring for their unique coats became evident. Number 13. Old English Sheepdogs are renowned for their remarkable intelligence and inherently cooperative disposition. Once they acquire knowledge or skills, they display an exceptional capacity for attention. However, it's important to note that these clever canines can become disinterested and restless when subjected to monotonous and mechanical training regimens. Number 14. Stanley Korn's book The Intelligence of Dogs places Old English Sheepdogs in the middle of the pack for obedience and intelligence at the 63rd spot out of 79 breeds. When training them, expect to repeat a command around 40 to 80 times for them to catch on. Familiar commands are usually mastered correctly on their first try about 30% of the time. Number 15. Old English Sheepdogs exhibit remarkable agility and speed. However, when they slow down, their gait transforms into a charming, ambling roll or shuffle, which has been described as rather bear-like. Number 16. Originally referred to as the Shepherd Dogs, the Old English Sheepdog made its debut in the illustrious realm of dog exhibitions at a prominent event held in the historic city of Birmingham, England in the year 1873. Number 17. In 1914, an Old English Sheepdog named Slumber made history as the first Best in Show winner at Westminster for his breed. Then in 1975, Ontario's Sir Lancelot of Barvin clinched victory, boasting 20 national titles from his home country. Number 18. The breed enjoys a typical life expectancy spanning a delightful 10 to 12 years. However, for owners who practice diligent care, a nourishing diet, consistent exercise, and vigilant veterinary attention for their pups, there's a chance to extend that joyful journey even further.
Number 19. While generally robust, bowling the sheepdogs, like any breed, may encounter specific health concerns, such as hip dysplasia, cataracts, glaucoma, entropion, thyroid issues, deafness, diabetes, progressive retinal atrophy, allergies, and other skin conditions. Number 20. Just like other breeds with merle coloring genes, it's crucial to test your old English sheepdog for MDR1, a genetic mutation that heightens sensitivity to specific drugs. Number 21. The origin of the old English sheepdog remains shrouded in mystery. Evidence points to a fascinating history dating back to the early 19th century in the picturesque landscapes of southwestern England. Yet there are hints of possible connections to the Scottish bearded collie or even the exotic Russian outcher. Number 22. In a splendid 1771 painting crafted by the renowned artist Gainsborough, there is a diminutive canine with charming, drooping ears. Many people speculate that this delightful creature might very well be an embodiment of the early prototype of the beloved Old English Sheepdog. Number 23. In the late 1880s, this breed rose to fame in the United States, embraced by affluent families such as the industrialist W. Wade. Their presence at prestigious dog shows like the 1904 Westminster Show marked a pivotal moment, catapulting them into the spotlight. Number 24. The American Kennel Club recognized the Old English Sheepdog in 1885, marking a momentous milestone for the breed. Number 25. Old English Sheepdogs currently rank as the 74th most popular choice among the 199 breeds listed by the American Kennel Club. Known for their charm, companionship, and impressive working skills, these dogs remain a favorite among enthusiasts, adding grace and joy to the world of pet lovers. Number 26. The cost of an Old English Sheepdog puppy from a well-established breeder falls within the range of $1,800 to $3,000, while at times top quality dogs are priced over $4,000. Number 27. In 1904, Henry Arthur Tilly and his brother William Steeds Tilly were visionary pioneers who founded the Old English Sheepdog Club of America and crafted the Enduring Breed Standard. Their legacy lives on in the pedigrees of today's sheepdog lines. Number 28. In 1961, the English paint brand Dulux featured an Old English Sheepdog named Shepton Daphnis Horse, nicknamed Dash, in their advertising campaigns. The story goes that Dash kept running across the set to play with the child actors and proved so adorable and eye-catching that the ad team decided to keep him in. Number 29. When Dash retired as the Dulux dog, a competition to find his replacement saw 450 Old English Sheepdog owners participating. The winner was a sheepdog named Fernbell Lord Digby, who would go on to become the most famous of the 14 pups who have worked as the Dulux dog so far. Number 30. The Old English Sheepdog excels in agility, obedience, and herding. Their natural herding instincts make them one of the top contenders in various competitions, showcasing their versatility and trainability. From herding trials to agility courses, these dogs are always up for a challenge. Number 31. In the cinematic masterpiece known as the Shaggy D.A., the charismatic and endearing presence of an old English sheepdog takes center stage, contributing to an undeniable charm and whimsical allure to the narrative. Number 32. Between the years 1933 and 1934, President Franklin D. Roosevelt briefly had the delightful companionship of an English sheepdog affectionately nicknamed Tiny. However, after enjoying Tiny's company for approximately a year, the compassionate president made the thoughtful gesture of gifting this charm charming canine to his close friend, Admiral Kerry Grayson. Number 33. In the enchanting cinematic revival titled The Return of the Shaggy Dog, the charismatic and endearing Old English Sheepdog takes center stage, captivating audiences with its whimsical performance and heartwarming charm. Number 34. Mr. Muggs, the lovable Old English Sheepdog, was the heartwarming star of a beloved children's book series created by Martha Cambites and Carol Roth. These books played a pivotal role in Canadian elementary education during the 1970s and early 1980s, fostering essential reading skills. Number 35. Martha My Dear is a song by the Beatles from their 1968 White Album, mainly penned by Paul McCartney and attributed to the Lennon-McCartney duo. It's a tribute to Paul's old English sheepdog named Martha. Number 36. The Old English Sheepdog enjoyed a prominent status within the circles of numerous influential American families, with a notable presence among the Vanderbilt, Morgan, Gould, and Guggenheim families. Alright guys, now which of these Old English Sheepdog facts intrigued you the most? Please let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.